or a six or more. Mm. Just yeah, try yeah. and solidify his position. As you see here, the surf from White Grange Larson coming around. He's just done his second turn. He's looking for a third. Bangs it up there as it runs into the hole there and finishes Outside. the side. Look at that. That's a big wave right there. And he's just going to rip straight into it. No holding back. Yeah. First big Rio coming off the bottom nice and strong. Huge carve right there. Another big turn right on the inside. Oh, that was and, critical. Uh, that's the beach waiting for him. He probably wants to go over to the channel, have it a bit of a bit of a breather. Here's John John Florence though, ladies and gents. Nice big first carve there. He comes through this inside bowl. It's got a beautiful wall to work with. Ah, oh, what about that turn right in the pocket? This wave is uh, cooperating very nicely with John John as he comes all the way through this inside. He's going to stick with it. Be careful. It's the danger zone in there. And uh, kicks out on the inside. Yeah. So Hang on here we go. He's, 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 he's pretty gingerly paddling back into the lineup. Lincoln Taylor up and riding. Oh. Big snap in the hook. And another big bottom turn. Swoop. This kid's got a powerful style. Bit of a wide stance, but that just makes him, you know... Powerful, like strong on his we'll board. Go yeah. to this wave here. Oh, 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 Jack Freestone throws himself into the lip, and he's going to drive up into the lip again. Oh, yes, he makes it. Well, some great surfing here from uh, young Jack Freestone, looking for a six-zero-one. Well, here we go, surfer in red. This is CJ Hobgood taking off on the first wave of the set. A bit of a bumpy one, but nevertheless, getting a nice tight oh. snap in air drops. And uh, comes in this inside bowl and getting another nice turn. He's going to get a little finishing section, section here for CJ. And uh, that's a great wave. He'll be happy with that one. Oh, no. Oh. What are you doing? When you're in that mess of foam, as you see up and riding, it is Gonzalez. This is actually Goni Zubazaretta oh, here. Oh, sorry, Goni, yep. Yep, on a big old right-hander here to start off his campaign in one of our final heats of the day. A few check turns, fades Bam. into that one. Yeah, big closeout re-entry there, Cole. Uh, we see a lot of guys with wider stances nowadays with the aerial manoeuvres, as we see outside. That is Jonathan Gonzalez, currently in third, needing a 6.27. Not the way he wanted to start. The second turn's a little bit better. Clean cutback, not a huge scoring turn. And that's the money kind of turns we want to see. And it's steep on the inside and finishes off with a nice little power snap and a little bit of a claim. Peter. And inside him is Thomas Hermes sitting in second place. Thomas needs to improve on a 1.83. He fakes Luke off that wave. It might have been a blessing for Luke. It doesn't look like it's that critical a, uh, section there for Thomas on the inside. He's making the most of it. Gets the closeout bang. A little bit of luck. Nick Muscroft sto scores starting to drop. The look at this paddle. And it is Nick Muscroft from Victoria. He's come in strong on this one. A great takeoff. There was a battle for the takeoff position. But Mushy's won that battle. And can he win the battle for the heat? He needs a 3.83. This is his second scoring ride. And, uh, well.